case, ladies. We're a little bit exhausted this morning on February 14th, 2021, trying to figure out how to get this set. We had a little tempting old difficulty. Yeah. So, just to warn our viewers and <laughs> new people that if it suddenly slips forward and we're talking like this <laughs> later on, it's because of technical issues we have with our recording equipment. So, and Miss Leah, how do you like it? Is it better? <laughs> You're up higher. Yeah. Do I have less of a double chin? <laughs> Can you believe so much oh dual has we had a double chin? Oh, oh, a double chin? I would. I, I'd be happy for just my one. double chins have friends. <laughs> okay. We cannot have them alone. You know, they have to stand together. You know, that's how it has to work. So. Good morning and happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Yeah, happy Valentine's Day. Yeah, she's not very happy at the moment. We gotta cheer her up. She's <laughs> like, which way do I do this? Too high, too low. Whatever. Oh, these technical I'm Sue. Worlds. Oh, I'm Micah. And I'm Deb. And this and is Flock Around the Lock Table. Flock Around the Table, episode what? What are we at? 34. 34. 34. On February 14th. Happy Valentine's, happy Valentine's Day. Day. And you know, I always think about what what was I doing when I was 34? And, um, you often think that, no, only when we do this, mm -hmm. I think, you know, you tell me a number and I think, Oh, what was, what I, was doing? I doing at that age? At Oof. that age, mm, I had two children and that was about the time I had my wisdom teeth taken out. Wow. Yeah. That was exciting. You have a good memory. 34. I don't even remember if I was 34. I think, I think so. It was right before 35. I had a teenager at the time. She had a teenager. See, I had, I had little people. I just had a husband that, Yeah. And a dog. And, and a dog. And a house. Had a teenager. And a job. I had a teenager. I'm sorry. I did. I had a teenager. Teenagers luckily outgrow that. Yeah, but thankfully. Thankfully they outgrow yeah. that. My yeah. granddaughter is, is a teenager now and um Thankfully she she too shall outgrow that. And thankfully she doesn't live in my house. Because <laughs> I hear she's a little cranky. <laughs> but I then, lived in a house with two brothers and two girls. And my younger sister, and, and Bethy Ann, who came 11 years later, <laughs> she made out like a champ because yeah, my mom was did. done. Mm -hmm. You know, she was over it. She mm -hmm. was like, the battles weren't even there to pick. It was like, yeah, yeah whatever. Right. Yeah. I mean, she was just, you know, so Bethy Ann kind of made out really well. And and like I mentioned, Doc was my the next one after me, and she could hide in plain sight. Do you have anybody have anybody like that in their family? Seriously. Mom would be like, Paul, go do this. Pete, do that. Debbie, come and do this. And then she had one mother task. So she would go do it. It was like Gail didn't even exist. Uh -huh. She couldn't see her. Even she was standing right in front. You know, this girl uh -huh. was totally like that. Um, and so yeah. waking, you know, having two brothers and, and my sister, uh, well, yeah, she didn't wake up well. She'd come down the stairs. That's what she did. <laughs> she was oh terrible. My goodness. And then when she became a doctor, and everybody were like, "Oh, I feel, I feel so for the person who, who calls her in the middle of the night." You know, she wakes She's up probably like that. Really good in the middle of the she night. She is. She wakes up. To she strangers. talks. Yeah, she talks. She gives them the orders. She goes right back to sleep. And Beth Ann said at one point, somebody called her. She was her. really just sleepwalking. Yeah. Yeah. She, somebody called and she didn't even remember that they called. And I said, well, that's real, you know, common good medicine there for a doc, but whatever. So, is everybody well, having a good day? Uh, you were the one that said wear red today. And you're. Oh, I didn't wear red because I wore my bone shirt. She's just wearing black with a little bit of red. It says yeah. be mine on it. <coughs> I have a skeleton. It's red velvet. Okay. Yeah. I'm the one that's really Valentine. -y. I even look. I even have Valentine socks. I show you, but I can't get my leg up there. See, maybe no. Nope. Oh, gosh, don't don't hurt Trust yourself. Us. Yeah. Don't, don't hurt you yourself. Really? She fell walking in today. Yeah. Yeah. I did. We I had took to a dive. I, and I was so helpful because I I stood at the top of the sidewalk and said, "Are you okay? Are you all right down there?" Yeah. And luckily, she said, "Yeah." <laughs> I had more snow in my bags than anything. And the problem is, you know, you're down. We well, got up. I was impressed well, with that. And you, you're like, how do I get up? You know, you're, you're like this and you're like on <laughs> ice and you're over there going, which foot, which hand do you use to back up so you Wait. don't slide back on your back? I don't. Again? I just roll around my ass. And I should have done that. Well, then 
your neighbor came out and then you try to have some decorum because you don't want the whole neighborhood to be like, hey, she's got drunken friends coming over on Sunday morning. As it is, her neighbor probably wonder what the hell's going on on Sundays that we have this, you know, secret meeting every Sunday. This blue car pulls up, this brown car pulls up. They both have these bags, you know. I mean, seriously. I know. It's our, it's our, it's the secret meeting of the yarn ladies. <laughs> it's not a very good secret. No, we're not. I mean, secret. not very secretive secret. But anyway, so, and then he wants to help. And at first I was like, ah, no. And then I thought. Like he could, I. I didn't, he had boots on. At least I saw his boots. I didn't have boots. I had tennis shoes. He's a nice man. And he is, he a, is nice a nice man. man. He's a nice man. I was impressed. He and even he, carried everything to the, to the sidewalk for me. And I thought that was really nice. And, yeah, and he's a good guy. I could have gone down there and helped you, but I had visions of lying there beside you. You had just warned me about the driveway too. Yeah. And so I didn't go up the driveway. I went on the side of the driveway. Sure, on the snow. And it kind of just, it went out from underneath me. I mean, what can I say? The earth moved under your feet. Yeah, we had an earthquake like they had in Japan. You know, and what was so funny is Jamie Jamie came in and, and announced to me earlier this morning, I shoveled the drivewalk for the ladies. He did. Or the sidewalk. Yeah. He did. Yeah. The sidewalk is perfect. Yeah, yeah. yeah it was just getting to it's, the sidewalk. It's down at the bottom where you, the road where they shovel everything yeah, gets yeah, you. Where I so. didn't, yeah. I, that was our entertainment for this morning. It was sheer entertainment. For it us. was exciting. It was. And then I came in and I threw everything on the floor and all the stuff. Dumped out all of her bags. She had <laughs> uh, chopped keys everywhere. Yeah. Because she has chopped keys and everything. snow. And snow. And I snow. The snow. Yeah, and, okay. yeah, she brought our. our you like our, this? Are these yeah. antlers? Believe it or not. These Aaron are not. Tenai. They're not. Oh yeah, wait. These are dollar store. Your pens are Michaels, but not dollar <gasps> store. They didn't have no, the cool ones. These are dollar store. No, I do Antennae. I'm calling them antennae. They are antennae. Yours is separate because it was pretty pink, so we had to have pink for you. Mm -hmm. Isn't that pretty cool? You're a pink girl. Yes, it's a treasure. See, they're not. Have you, ever, <laughs> you guys are probably out there going, okay, next holiday, St. Patrick's Day, what's she going to do on that day? And these two are sitting here going, oh, God, another thing Patrick's that we'll day. have to put on our head. Yeah. And I told it'll my, have shamrocks on it, and it'll be green and sparkly. I can or, see it already. Or a little leprechaun hat. <gasps> I can't go too crazy, though. Oh because, my gosh. You know, the little <gasps> side leprechaun hat would be, you know, be cute. a I fastener. Go. I need a fastener right here. Okay. You know. All right, so I'll work for, look for the leprechaun hat. <laughs> See, then they pick on me. Now I bring in this stuff. Well, I want an Ed leprechaun hat. See, so then I, I have to go out and look for Well, I really think that hat. we should um, probably start a storage box here at Sue's house and put all of our paraphernalia in. I like how you say that here at Sue's house. <laughs> Because then one will find it next year. And yeah. two, it's at Sue's house. Not and it will be lost. No, yeah. I've already decided... That um, I, I'm going to um, commission the recycling plant because I know <laughs> Deb will just bring us new stuff next year. She'll have oh. to have an excuse to shop. I have to go to the dollar. I store. really kind of thought she might. We might just put these back out again next year. Um, they're old and 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 they might um, get smushed. Yeah, they would get smushed. Not if we and put them in a special and, box. New and later and create us newer. Yeah, things. what if next year they have? Oh, um, they may light up next year. Yeah, right. see, see. Oh. Or, you know, I may go to Disney a, and they might have Minnie Mouse or something that's really cool. I think my, my antlers are... I think little... I will just wear these until oh, they today? completely fall apart. I think I'm going to the warehouse with these. <laughs> <laughs> and my safety orange. Your you know, safety orange t-shirt. Yeah, you... my safety orange. And, and of course, she got us these, these lovely... Oh, I'm going to have to go in pink. But, yeah, uh, a little heart. Color yeah, my pens. Color pens. See, because every day when I check something off, I use a different color. I use it. That, so that says it's purple, and that's kind of pink. I don't well, know. No, no, no. This, if you want to see the pink, here's the pink. This is pink. Okay. Okay. And then this one oh is God. the purple. I checked them before I used it. They're they are see? completely fascinated in that. They are. It really. You want to see? It works. No, Trust me. no, no. I wouldn't okay. lie to you. Everybody has to have colored pants. I love colored pants. See, now you'll, today you marked it with pink. Uh, no, that's purple. Okay, well. That <laughs> <laughs> you just told me that. I'm like, no, oh, that looks pink to me. Oh, okay, well, whatever. whatever, you know, so. Uh, yeah. I, I, 
I yeah. think I told you guys, but I didn't tell them guys last week that I was going to really try to have the orgasm done done this week. And I'm not quite there. She didn't quite get that orgasm together. No, but it's... It's a, I'm close. I'm close. I'm on the decrease. I'm on the downward slope towards the end. Um, well, and there's something in it about Valentine's and orgasm that kind of goes together. I was going to say they go hand in hand, but <laughs> <laughs> right. I was waiting for that. That was good. That go Sorry. Together. Sometimes I just got to go there. Huh. Um, uh, well, I I live in the gutter, so you just have to come down I just into visit my once realm while. every once in a while. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, hand in hand. Well, that's all right. Then we can stay and yeah. look at what. Oh made yeah. Me. She I made did. me a little little tchotchke dish. Yep. To put your you know your little doodads. Chotch keys and okay, oh, you know, stitch markers, markers and such. I have your, to get on your mine. bedside because right at oh, you have you have stitch markers at your bedside. I do I, actually. Do you really? <laughs> oh my god, you are ridiculous. I have stitch markers. I have a measuring tape. I have just about every. I have one of these kits that I have to keep it. I think one of these is at every spot in the house. So that's you know. I'm just one of those people that have it everywhere. You traveled with me, so you know what I have. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and I was explaining to somebody else um, your incredibly odd sense of... Um, uh, you have a bag for everything. <laughs> she does. She has a bag for everything. She I do. has a separate bag for each curling iron, and she has to have like three different curling irons, I think, for her non-hair... Um, you never know when you want to do something with it. And then they have a bigger one and a little one, and then the curling dryer. Right, and they each have their own bag, and then they all go into a bag. And all shoes, the bags go into a bag. And my shoes have a bag. And, and shoes have a bag. Right, and my knitting all has a bag. And then each have a bag, and then separate things inside of there have bags. But yeah. So her nickname is Bob. Bag. Oh, B Bob. Bob, which means bunches of bags. Bunches of bags, and. Yep. And I, I knew that was her well, nickname prior to us, bag. you know, doing this podcast. But I never really understood the whole concept <laughs> of it until I actually traveled with her. I think the amount of bags that she had with her potentially could have filled up my carry-on. Just the bags. Not the contents in the bags. Just the bags themselves. The small carry-on. Not the big carry-on. Which she traveled with a suitcase and I a carry-on. Your, ba your, 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 yeah. your bag, your bag, your bag, carry-on, and then um, your suitcase. A big suitcase. I did. I traveled with a carry-on and my knitting bag. She did. And I shopped and I still got it all in my carry-on. Even with the Lego. Even with Lego mm -hmm. on the way back. But I didn't have separate bags for everything. I just like my bags. It's organization, folks. It's the way... Wait, I just made a big hoop up. Can't I was going to show you what Deb made me for... Um, yeah, do that while I'm trying to figure yeah. out how to do this, this. And I don't know that you're going to be able to read this. Mm. I could bring it up front and close and center for them to be able to read. <laughs> It says, you are my, you're my favorite semi-tolerable person. <laughs> I saw that and immediately thought of you. Seriously. <sighs> it jumped into my head. Oh my God, I got to do that for Micah. I did. It was, it was like so I don't totally know, do weird. I take that as a compliment or yeah. do I, okay. Because I didn't think that of anybody else. Just you. <laughs> Just you, dear. Just, Just me. You. Just, Just you, me. dear. So you know that could be a coaster, or you know. Well, it you could need. be. It could hold my my stitch markers. And your and a sandwich. And a sandwich. Yeah, I mean, or if you carry it's your a small cup sandwich, of, cup of that wouldn't even soup. come close to holding my stitch markers. No, not yours. Well, not yours. Talk about people having a bunch of stitch markers. <coughs> this one has like. It's got a tackle box full. Yeah. For sure. Or but you, two she, boxes. she sells them. Um, you can purchase them on the Felted Garden. I do. I have most of I have a good I have a good lot of them on the Felted Garden. A now. good lot. A good lot of them are on the Felted Garden now. 
Or and the at big the ones village. On there. Yeah, I do got the big O rings. Yeah. On there now. And they are handy. I have to admit, I use them on my gridiron hat. Thank you, Sir. The big, the big, the big ones. Yeah. And yeah. they they work really well, and they were much better than some of the thicker ones that I've used in the past. For because well, I you don't know, use even the plastic. Yeah, even the little plastic ones. The, yeah. The, the so this kind, yeah. they don't fit over. No, they but, don't. So that was handy to have. The um, you gave us a twenty twenty one, or twenty and twenty twenties. Yeah. Well, up to twenty twenty, but um, I'm started this sweater four times so far. <coughs> uh oh. And I'm using the twenty twenty one marker as then, the beginning of round. And then she'll have a twenty two up here. And then she'll have a <laughs> <laughs> and this oh, sleeve will be dear. 27, you know. And you guys will be like, oh, my God, we're going to see that sweater again. Well, come on, Micah, let's go. You know, I didn't bring it with me because all it is is a, a, a cast on. We'll send it to Valerie. She would finish it for you. <laughs> Hi, Valerie. Hi, Valerie. The sweater's on its way. I forgot to bring it today, but we'll get it taken care of. <laughs> I found a couple of real, every time I kind of see it, a uh, uh, pullover type sweater on Ravelry or on websites or something, I have to admit, I do kind of think, I'm thinking, she might be able to get that one done. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm not kidding. It's like, yeah, I think that could be hers. And then all I'm finding is a bunch of, I like cardigans, you like pullovers. Oh, I like pullovers. She, does, she likes pullovers. Yeah. She does like cardigan sweaters, but she never wants them finished them. Mm -hmm. She doesn't wear cardigans, she wears pullovers. My sweaters, I've done two pullovers and two cardigans, and I don't wear the pullovers, so. Well, you don't wear the cardigans much either. I do. I wear a cardigan all the time, but it's always coming off because I get but it's hot. But it's not a knitted one, is it? No, not it's a Not one that she knitted. It's a Kohl's one. It's, it's a Kohl's shirt. shirt. It's a Kohl's, yeah. Yeah. It's, a it's red. Stuff. See, so I wore a red sweater, see? Red sweater to go with my yeah. new mine. Red yeah. velvet, Bones Coffee, isn't that the cutest thing? So he's so cool. I wore it to dinner, Valentine's dinner. We did ours on Friday night. And I have to tell you about this. My husband took me out. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is great. <laughs> yeah. And um, we he's went a good, to a place guy. called, yeah, he is. He really he's is. He thought guy. ahead and he planned this. And we went, um, we went to the hardware store. Okay. For dinner. For dinner. Time. They actually have a little grill there. It's called Sully's Grill. And they made this, set it all up, and decorated it. And he had all these beautiful clematis plants sitting out. You know, mm -hmm. in the hollow, in the little baby roses, you buy plants and stuff. Yeah. For, and so the place looked amazing, the way it was decked out and everything and, and stuff. And so he's done this before, the Sullivan's Hardware. It's at 71st and Keystone in Indianapolis. Giving you a dig there, Mr. Pat Sullivan. Great guy. They do a show on Saturday mornings, and they sound like us. <laughs> I'm sure they do. <laughs> They're always picking on poor Pat. And yeah, anyway, so they have people call in asking, you know, hardware questions and gardening questions and stuff oh, like that. Uh -huh. So it's a really good show, and it's on the radio, not on YouTube. And um, Gosh, she squirrels. Wait, I know. I'm telling squirrels. them. Stop. Just fucking squirrels And they have the a time. Other than that, it's just like us. But other than that, it's just like us. You guys find they're following me. Just I don't see anybody out there complaining. Just you two. Wait so, to see the comments. Anyway, <laughs> it's going to be go, right. Deb, go. <laughs> they have a train. They have a, a little train that has like eight well, cars. Well, it's got to be bigger than that. Well, no, because you can sit in it, but you have to sit like this. You know what I mean? And you can, Mikey and I can sit in a car, and they take you around. It's like four and a half minute train ride through these little buildings that they've put like Christmas decorations up, and then they turned them into the reindeer had. Um, Antlers with hearts on them and stuff. It was hysterical. I thought these were antenna. Well, okay. But they are That's hearts. what I call them. <laughs> she called them antenna. I call And we had a comedy show and everything else and champagne and dessert. It was really nice. That my husband did. Did your husbands take you to a hardware store? Oh. See, I have a special husband. You probably all went to a nice dinner. Probably going out this afternoon or having them bring food in or something. No. I go to a hardware store. Well, mine said this morning, I didn't get you anything for the Hallmark holiday, holiday honey. <laughs> that's what he said to me this morning. Really? Talk about a cop -out. I said, well, that's good. I didn't get you anything for the Hallmark holiday either. I did. I got him gloves. These really cool gardening gloves. And they're guaranteed for three years. Not to. 
Did you get them at for what? Nope. the hardware store? They carry them, but I got the better brand from QVC. Oh, <laughs> I got the QVC. Hey, I'm social distancing. I'm staying out. You know, I had to shop. You were already at the freaking hardware store. But they were not open. They were just having the, the show. Oh, and so the you dinner. couldn't buy like. I probably could buy gardening gloves there. I couldn't buy Apparently gardening gloves. Not. I did go check and see if they carried them, but Mikey says the ones I got him are the better ones, are the grade up than what they carry in the hardware store. God knows, Mikey needs the grade up. Well, yeah, because you can get a warranty on them. They're warrantied for three years. I do have a little project for Mikey. Okay, well, you have to let him know. Yeah, my, my Swift, um, when it, you know, it clamps on the table, mm -hmm. but for some reason it's funky, and it won't hold, and as I'm winding it'll fall off which makes winding yarn very much more difficult. Maybe you need to put the, a holder so it stays on the... And you put a little, a little, a little piece, piece of wood. Or well, a, that's what I thought. I thought a yeah, piece of wood might help. And, um, or a piece of rubber. I, I, I also rubber. thought Gorilla Glue, but I... You don't want no, to you don't want to do no. that. No, because then you can't no, use No, just use part. a little piece of um, like rubber. Or I don't have couple a little things. piece of you have a I'll get you some. We'll give you some. I'll show you. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, I, I'm having winding issues. So, um, not, it's also a not winding, winding issue. Issue. Not winding winding. issues. No, I was, they're winding. <laughs> anyway, I was winding this <laughs> yarn that I've gotten from Ridiculous to make my sweater, which um, we've already talked about four times. Um <clears throat> Hopefully next week I can bring it in and and you can see how far I am. The the yarn itself I did a swatch, um, and I think it's going to be really pretty. Okay. Uh, it the way it um, the colors kind of knit up, I think it's going to be a really pretty sweater and everyone's going to be jealous. But um, so far I have the cast on and that's it. So it's going to be a while. Your jealousy won't have to. You don't need to be jealous yet. No, no. We'll Save let it. you know <laughs> at some point in the future, somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Shush. Well, and last week, remember, I showed my yarn, uh -huh. my Boogie Boogie Christmas yarn. Yes. From Game Crackers. Oh, yeah. And look what I finally, I got one done. It's, it, I'm adding this. I like pan. how that pooled. It's fun. Isn't it yeah. fun? Yeah. I, yeah, it kind of swirls. Yeah, yeah it, swirls it did. It turned, the pan. That's cool. And you add the thumb on after the fact. but It's I, an afterthought thumb. After th that's actually what it's called. And well, and so thumb. you can't hitchhike until you it's have like the thumb. It's like an afterthought heel. You so know. Mm -hmm. um, this is a Oogie Boogie Christmas, but I'm going to use it for St. Patrick's Day. So that's why we're having mittens done in Oogie Boogie Christmas. For and you St. altered Patrick's. your pattern to make it a little smaller to fit your hand better, right? I did. Yeah. See? I went down the size in the needle. Oh my gosh, you're a oh. pattern writer -er already. Oh, speaking of pattern writer -ers. <laughs> Talk about segueing here, I'm telling you. And so you're gonna have the you're gonna have the next one of this done before St. Patty's Day? Yeah. Okay, so you can wear them on St. Patty's Day. Yeah. Okay, Actually, good. I'm going to start wearing them once they're done. Because my <laughs> well, no. not before. <laughs> not a second before either. Well, you're strict. <laughs> because the black ones, Isn't you remember that? I did the black ones? My sister's dog just said, and they were a little loose, and he comes up and he, and he grabbed it, and he took off, and he ran around the yard with it, and it's all full of snow and cold and everything. But then I really, he put a hole in it, so now I have to fix it. So, um if the, this one, he wouldn't be able to pull off because it's a lot tighter and it fits better. So there you have it. And the pattern is just called Plain White Mittens. And I'm, I'm, and I'm going to send a thank you note to the actual writer. I didn't realize this has sparkle in it. Yeah, it does. It's got sparkle in it, guys. And it's you sparkly. probably can't see too much, but mm -hmm. it's got a bit of a sparkle yeah, to it. Yeah, it's got sparkle. Yeah. It, looks like it, has, it looks like it's been dusted with snow. Pixie dust. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Pixie dust. Watch it, lady. <laughs> <laughs> so this was my work this and you know I didn't do anything until Thursday. And I started this Thursday night. And I worked And that's on, DK though too, right? Yeah. Yeah. And I took it to the dinner. Oh. Oh. Because I figured i you know, I knew there was a little well, show afterwards. So you wouldn't have to talk to Mikey? Yeah, exactly. So I kept I kept knitting and Everybody was kind of looking around at it and stuff, and some girl goes, are you making a sleeve? And I wanted to say, yeah, it's for Micah's sweater. It's for Micah's sweater. But, um, <laughs> I didn't, because I didn't, she didn't understand the whole reference with Micah. So I said, no, it's a mitten, and, and she was like, oh, that's really cool. And, and she goes, and I was like, up here. 
and she just sort of looked at it and then and I stuck it on my hand for the waitress and everything and I was like this and I said I put the thumb <laughs> it's a bunting mitten we actually just don't even put thumbs in at all we just let it be well I found a pattern for little baby mittens and With they no don't thumb. put no, they, they don't, don't, don't put, put thumb in it. So no, this is like, like I mean, like two seconds later, you're like you put two rows of, of ribbing in, and then three rows, and then you decrease, and then yeah, you have a baby yeah. mitten. So yeah. that was pretty cool. I remember I like, I have putting to do those, those little mittens on my kids because they would Keep, poke themselves in the eye with their or scratch. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so. Those fingernails. Um, speaking of modifying a pattern. <laughs> yeah. This oh, your pretty. modified pattern. How did it, did you block it? She no, I have not blocked it And yet. a lot of people okay. look, I heard some people were watching her on Wednesday. They were morning. watching, but it, I mean, it really is cool the way it, it fans, here. Yeah, it, it is cool. The way it fans out. I've not blocked it yet. Oh my gosh, look at that. Isn't but it's that not so at cool? all according to pattern. No, it's but not. It's, okay, it's not, it's really it's not nice. according to pattern at all, but look at, guys. It's oh my really gosh, nice. that is Look cool. at how beautiful that yeah, turned yeah, I mean, out. I could hold that in, couldn't I? Yeah, you could. Look at, the, look at it kind of fans out here and it lays over there. It's really beautiful. Yeah, I like Yeah, no, this is cool. This turned out really nice. But not according to pattern at no, all. No, it's not according to pattern. So but yours may not look the same way as hers. No, it most definitely won't. No. If you do the no. whole pattern, it won't look like this at all. No. Oh, wait, I'm so sorry. But, yeah. I mean, well, this is the Hope chaos. I'm just yarn. glad that, that you finished it. This is well, chaos. didn't have sleeves. And it didn't have sleeves. <laughs> this is chaos cornucopia, right? Yes, it is chaos, chaos cornucopia. Cornucopia. We'll make this for you guys if you want to, you know. But you'd have to ask her how she modified the pattern, how he's patterned to make it look like this. Yeah. But um, it's a secret. Well, it's well, a secret just, society you're part of, so I, I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, I mean, that's a cool society. I don't, yeah. I don't know where it comes from. I'm not, I'm not a part of that society. Obviously. Either, but whatever. But it is... It is oh. cool. I think it will be interesting. It looked when really you block nice. It. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. I want to see if I can get a point the final to it. shape. You know, but yeah. um, it, um, anyway, so there it is. I did finish it. Um, she wore it with a brown sweater. It looked really nice. I'm sure on it did. Wednesday. I mean, it's I'm sure it did. It was a black sweater. Was it? Yeah. Black. Brown. Black. Brown, She's colorblind. Brown, brown. I, don't have, I don't have a brown sweater. I could have sworn it was brown. Was it brown? No. I'm gonna start is this color pictures. brown? No, this is black. Okay. <laughs> and your car. Sure. You said your car was brown. It is brown. It's called Kodiak Brown. Okay. But it looks black. Or it, it looks purple. Look cool. Looks dark navy. I was going to say it looks purple. My shirt? Oh. Nope. My shirt is black. <laughs> Whatever. After that scintillating bit of conversation. But anyway, I, so I here's this. I think it's cool. Yeah, I'm happy with it. I um, too. And I I've already worn it. Did if she wear I wore it to another broken egg. I could wear it with this sweater. You could. You could wear it with that sweater. Are you cold? No. Okay. But I was going to demonstrate how it's I It's a perfect it. size. It's a good size. Yeah, yeah. It, how it many really, skeins? Does that have Almost two, two full skeins. Almost two full ones. Yeah, yeah, so once it blocks, it's probably going to be big enough for a... For anyway. making a fort in your living room? Yeah. It's like I told Somebody you. said that they, they would hang their shawls on the wall, and this would be like the yeah. south wall. Yeah. That I, probably, well, no, that's the north wall. Well, I told her when I finish painted bricks, it's going everywhere. It's going to be my blanket. I don't care. That, <laughs> that painted bricks is going anywhere and everywhere I go. It's going to have its own bag. <laughs> well, I, I think the big O will go with me everywhere. It just seems like I've been doing that one forever. Yeah, we have yeah. to take that yeah. one with. It's not mm -hmm. it's not exactly the most exciting of colors, but I like it because mm -hmm. oh, it's just so soft. Sorry, it I really have the hiccups. I will I will I, I I'm writing the pattern up too, so I will get a pattern for you guys if you you so so desire to have a pattern for it. <laughs> You've seen it so long, you know, it's like you're part of your whole environment it's here. Twelve, probably thirteen hundred yards. <gasps> wow, that's big. Yeah. Of, of softness, of yarn. orgasmic softness. Of, of orgasmic softness. I'm not sure. Like, you know, let me go grab it because I'm not sure exactly how many how many yards are on each day. She's gonna go grab it. She, I'm gonna go get my we'll pause here and take a station break. We could do, sing. Do, 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 no, that's Alex Trebek. Do, 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 that's the only song I know through. Do, 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 do. 
Oh, you know okay, what? Go. There's 402 yards. So, yeah, 1,200 yards. 1,200 yards. Wow. yards on it. it so I'm on the I'm on the downward slope. Um, I could sleep I'm on the, with I'm this. I'm on the decrease. I could sleep with... Wait, whoa, wait. I'm tangled. Hold I know on. you are. That's why I I'm fixing. Watch. I'm fixing. Hold on. You have to learn to tolerate me. <laughs> I have the perfect things. <laughs> So I have turned the corner, <laughs> guys. I have turned the corner. So I'm, you know, I'm at, I'm at the, the finishing end. This so soft. You have no idea if you had a touch of vision, we could have you touch, touch a it. vision. We yeah. could touch it. We'll, we'll take it out. Let me go. It, it will not be nine feet long like I had hoped, but. Be close. Well, but nine feet would be a wait, bit much. No, wait. I like nine feet. Nine feet is wait, good. Wait, this is 60 inches right here. I know. I know, but I'm already on the decrease, so, okay, so, so well, it won't be nine feet. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> nine feet. I like nine feet because when you wrap it around once, you still have a, a enough good where tail. it's coat length. Well, you're taller than I am. I don't like it By more than six. two inches, maybe. Yeah, but I don't like sixty inches because then it's too, I can't manhandle it. It's sixty inches. But that's a that. shawl. This is more like a scarf. Well, huh? What's the difference between a shawl and a scarf? A scarf is like skinny heft. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, that just turned that. Mm -hmm. Webster, here, let's write this new definition. I, well, I mean, a shawl usually is not the shape of a scarf. True. But it can be okay. rectangle. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, you guys give us your definition. Yeah, give me yours. I okay. want to know what your definition is exactly. between a scarf and a shawl. And like when I categorize my patterns, if it says that it's a shawl slash wrap, and it only takes one skein, I put it in the cowl scarf section because to me that's more of a scarf than it is a shawl. You're looking at me like I know, and I really don't. Well, I want to include you in the conversation, call, even though you, we could cut off right here. Because <laughs> you don't get me half the time anyway, so whatever. I know, but I try to follow. So I don't, I know, know, I don't know what to categorize this then because it's, it's really it's, yummy. It's yummy. I it's, think it's a. It's it's it doesn't wider matter. than a scarf. Yeah, I think it's a wrap. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. But I'm going to use it more like a scarf around my neck. You can use it any way you want it, and you can call it whatever. you I can want. call it whatever I like, but but and what would you guys call it? So orgasm. Oh no, orgasm. <laughs> <laughs> it's closest I've come. <laughs> hmm. Decades. It's more like a table runner. <laughs> don't, my God, don't use it for a table runner. I can see you out in public. Oh, yes, this is my favorite. Table table my lovely runner. table runner. Do you like my table runner? It's fantastic. Oh, my goodness. Um, yeah. I don't know. We'll have to see. What would you call it? I'd call it a wrap. I'd call it a wrap. Yeah. Do we get, Okay, that's, that's, that's a wrap. wrap. It's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. It's a wrap. wrap. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa! I hit your Bialis. She had the, we had Bialis this morning for breakfast with a wonderful breakfast that we had. Now, where'd they, where'd they come from? Fair, Bagel Fair and Nora. Okay. It's a, it's a fancy bagel. Yeah, it's a Polish bagel. It's a Polish bagel is what it is. And it's yeah. got onions and poppy seeds and stuff on it. It was really good. They're mm -hmm. really good. I wasn't sure I was going to get them because of Valentine's. I actually went to see if they had red... Um, bagels that's what i was looking for and i figured they'd probably have heart donuts red mm -hmm. bagels but i was looking for like something red or maybe you know <coughs> they could put a red <coughs> eye in it and it'd be really cute for me a beet flavored bagel would yeah, be yummy yeah that'd be yummy oh uh, well they have veggie ones and they have salt actually and... a beet flavored bagel doesn't sound bad to me no i like beets. i don't like beets i like beets oh i love beets. i like beets. i have beets, beets in my fridge today i'm probably going to roast them Ooh, I, I really have a beet. problem with most purple foods. You don't like eggplant either? Eh. Well, I the like actual eggplant. eggplant itself is not purple. That's just the, the part that you eat is not purple. 
Yeah, it's no, it's just got a purple skin. I'm not keen on blueberries either. Wow. So, it's that color group. Although I do like it's kind grapes. Of an un- it is kind of an unnatural color. Yeah, it doesn't seem like food should be that color. color. Hmm. My mother-in-law used to pickle beets, and she would give them to my husband. I love them. And I love he loved beets. them. He thought they were just wonderful. And he would say to me, why don't you pickle beets? And I said, because I hate beets. And mm. he didn't understand that that was... Besides, I didn't pickle anything. Why would I pickle beets? I don't so. know how to pickle anything. Well, I think you just put vinegar on it or something. I don't know. I don't know. Isn't there a pickling solution? Maybe. Yes. Okay. Well, then maybe that's what you do. I don't, I really I don't. know Bobby Flay does it every once in a while on Beat, Beat Bobby Flay. He'll like throw his onions or he'll his quick, cabbage. He'll do a quick, quick pickle. pickle. He'll do a quick I've pickle. I've heard a quick pickle. Quick pickle? Yeah. 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 Quick pickle. And I, I'm like, no. no, you're just the pickle. Did you ever watch Bobby Flay? It drives me crazy. How sometimes. did we get to there? Because he was pickling. Pickles. Oh, pickles. That's how... That's how she jumped over to that. Okay, all right. All I right. think that Bobby realm. Flay should have us on there. We could beat Bobby Flay. With what? Sue, she could beat Bobby <laughs> Flay. <laughs> Not me. <clears throat> Only if well, we, we have a big stick. Hey, what's your signature dish? An orgasmic Breakfast. wrap. <laughs> Breakfast. <laughs> An my orgasm. Sign- <laughs> my signature dish? It's a peanut butter sandwich. There you go. See? Take out. <laughs> Yeah, you you're, you're, you have the phone down packed. So. Yeah, they were posting I, food last night on our WhatsApp app. With our WhatsApp group. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, I mean, these big, beautiful meals with, with short ribs and, and... What was it that we made? Was it ribs or... Short ribs. Yeah, short, short ribs yeah. and roasted beet vegetables. The I, vegetables. And I was, so as soon as she said that, I'm like, okay, I'm coming over. Yeah. Like, I just made, like... A quick spaghetti with some chicken on top of it. Yeah. Um, But who else was cooking? Sharon. 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 Sharon, Of course, Sharon was. Okay. Sharon's having chicken piccata today because it's the hubby's birthday. Yeah. So they're cooking all these wonderful dishes. I'm eating my peanut butter sandwich (laughs) thinking there's something (laughs) wrong here. Of course, it's just me at home. And... And Jen posted those brownie things oh, that yeah. looked like amazing. And, and they, they were, were made from quinoa, quinoa which yeah, is pretty cool. Yeah, they were cool. gluten-free and egg-free, egg-free dairy-free. Dairy yeah, they're, they looked amazing. Yeah, they're with these chocolate little hearts quinoa on them. brownies with yeah. uh, raspberries on top. They, they, they look, look like fantastic. little hearts but on top. It was so cute. I, I said I bet they weren't calorie-free. I had a request from the one in the other room. Yeah. Uh-huh. This morning, you did, yeah. Which doesn't happen. Do you really very want often. to share that with your visitors? Well, it's a Valentine's Day request for popovers. Uh, ow! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going somewhere yeah, else. No, he doesn't want anything like that. He just wants food. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. I've been there, done that. Popovers. Then, yeah, popovers would be good. She makes really good popovers. Yeah, he said. He said, "I'm going to make a request. Can you have popovers?" And you said, "Sure." And I said, "Yeah, of course. Whatever. I don't care." But she didn't make them today because we didn't have She may have made them for her him. No, I did not make them for she's, breakfast she, for him. If she's going to make them, she's going to make more than two. Well, <laughs> right. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Got to get See? the recipe. So we don't have any new yarn this week. Yes, we do. We, do we? we don't? Yes, we do. We do. <gasps> I didn't even know. I have. Oh, fighting. She doesn't share this with me. See, we don't. We don't. This. Oh. <gasps> This what is on earth is that? Yes, what on earth is this? It casual is casual fashion queen. Casual fashion queen. O M G. Here, I'll stand. <laughs> Look at that. Casual fashion queen. I just found her and um, check out those the colors. kabuki. Uh huh. Called the kabuki. Look at these colors on here. Wow. Jeez, yep. this is going to make something fantastic. I know. A casual fashion queen. Probably a shawl or a wrap. Wow. Isn't that a fun that's name? That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Isn't that a fun name? Casual. Maybe that's what I should just call the big orgasm. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Yeah, mark. it's... Um, Question mark. <laughs> It's 80-20 uh, merino and nylon, but it's got a real nice feel to it. Um, 
Yeah, yeah. I'm real happy with it. I think it's going to be stunning. And I, I have to confess, I sit at home in my recliner, and out in front of me is my coffee table. On my coffee table are all these yarns that you've seen me show you over the past several weeks. And as I'm sitting there, I, I look at them and think, Oh, God, I really want to knit that up. Oh, no way, I want to knit that up. And I went, knit that up. And so it's it's like, I really need elves to come in and help knit up my yarn. <laughs> now, if you could just get your cleaning lady instead of hiding it to knit it, yeah. you'd be okay. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, you just go. need this. this. Oh, it's, and it's a nice. I like Doesn't the way it rolls together. It's going to be interesting once you kind of roll it out. Yeah, to to wind it, it's it's. Um, yeah, I don't think it's striping, mm -mm. but no. Um, no, yeah, not. I was real pleased with it. It was, like I said, I found this. I think probably on Instagram. I saw, and what I do is I see the name of a, a dyer, and then I look it up on Google, and um, if they have a a website that I can easily navigate. <laughs> I will sometimes buy yarn if they have a website that I can't navigate. I don't. You know that if you see it on Instagram, you can usually go to their page and they have a link to their own website there and you don't have to Google it? Yeah. 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 Makes I it didn't easier. Know that. Yeah. Well, well, I didn't know that. This like, is cool. Kind of like ours. Like if they come to our Instagram page, they can just go to our homepage and see like the link and they come to our as YouTube As you said page. that, I knew it, but then I haven't <coughs> done it. <laughs> I confess, I haven't done it. Although sometimes I do click on them, and they'll have a shop mm -hmm. on Instagram. Mm -hmm. And I always like that. I got on my Instagram, and I touched on something, and it went, whoop, and then turned off. So I don't get on Instagram anymore. I yeah. thought I so anyway, this is my latest acquisition, not counting. I got a sock, a sock, a sweater quantity from Webs, and I'll show you that next week. This is For your fun. sweater. But you need for to, another sweater. For another you, sweater. This, your other mission this week. You need help. <laughs> I need I need you need a ten-step program. I think we did. <laughs> I need an intervention. Um, no, what? What? You I, need to spin one of these, and you need to make a swatch so we can see that next week. They need to see a swatch of this. You're so bossy. I know. I think it's because it's. I got antennas today <laughs> no, I'm getting electrical current in my head <laughs> you know. okay I have another little thing uh, you're you, you, stealing the show today mm, mm -mm. well a while ago you complained because I wasn't talking mm -hmm. yeah so just what what do we got this is um, I got my last um, uh, club yarn from this is Lolo did it no, it's Savvy Skeins. I'm sorry. Savvy Skeins. And this is the um, Stranger Things. Oh, your uh, Stranger Things club yeah. that you're in? And I got the last two. And what I'm thinking. So. Sorry, uh, sorry for the crinkling. So if you are a member of the Savvy Skeins Club and you don't want to see the color waves, Turn it off right now. Here. Well, I'll, I don't I'll cover I your like eyes. I just Here. got this earlier in the week. I'm covering your eyes. Well, maybe so you can't somebody see. hasn't opened it yet. So we're just. If you, you know, haven't opened your squishy mail, you don't have to because I've got it. Um, You'll see it now. Well, but this, look this, and. <laughs> or don't. You know, for those people who live in the UK and haven't gotten theirs yet, PSA, close your eyes. Look you don't want to see together. what. See what the last two. If I'm thinking, well, maybe the like the lady in Sweden, maybe she doesn't get hers, and now she's all excited because she gets to see it. See, so we're, right. we're well, okay. you never know. We're performing a service for our for our guests. I have two other skeins, and I think the cleaning ladies put them away. But my thought is that I could take all four skeins, put them together, fade them, and make a T-shirt. Which I think would be really pretty, because those two go together really well. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. I, well, don't don't hold your breath. Yeah. Because again, it's, it's a sweater. Because with... a t-shirt will have sleeves, so, uh, yeah. Well, but they have short sleeves. Short sleeves. Short sleeves. Yeah. And it, she gives up about it a short sleeve length. No, I don't. No, I, the, the Dirty ones... Martini. Need I say more? 
It has a whole big honking sleeve. One sleeve, and the oh, other I one has like this much. Well, and I didn't do the other one because See? the first one is wrong and has to be torn out. So. Well, what's wrong about it? Why can't you just leave it Because that way? of going, rather than going in, it's going out. It well, is, you want it that way. No, I didn't want it that way. So wear a bandage on your arm when you wear that sweater. <laughs> Hush. Maybe Put you should on. just, um, tink, not tink, but pull out to a short sleeve and then just do the other one. To a short I'm sleeve centered line. to Valerie. Okay. okay. Valerie, you're on. And for the rest of you who don't know Valerie Unfortunately, Valerie, you, Va you oh. asked for it. <laughs> it's coming no your way. Yeah. <laughs> Valerie offered to do my sleeves. She said she'd do four sweaters. The sleeves of four sweaters. The sleeves of four sweaters if I sent her a shawl. Honey, you're on. She'll send you two shawls. Yeah. She'll I didn't even let you have your choice. Actually, what we'll do is we'll send, send you a photo. <laughs> yeah, Valerie, what color would you what like? What colors would you like, darling? <laughs> How about we just send you a ticket and you can fly it up on Southwest and then fly back, you know? Pick it out. I'm not sending her a ticket. I have points. We can use that. Oh, okay. You know, we can get her up here. Anyway. <laughs> Instead of stalking her in wherever well, she's at, we'll, she's we'll bring her Texas. up here. She's in Texas. She's in Texas. Texas is a big place. It yes, is. Yes, it is. Yep. It is. So, anyway. Yeah. They were once their own separate country. Oh my gosh. Yeah, at one point in time. <sighs> all right. Okay, so that's all I have this week. This I'm is, this is how far I am now on Lopito. Wait, wait. This is how far I am on Lopito. I'm only doing it while we're podcasting here with you guys. Me so. too. <laughs> she's actually farther along in the pattern than yeah, I yeah. am. <laughs> but she's just in their needles than I am. So this will be my little scarf that we'll just have. It will just be a little scarf. And mine, this is um, Hibiscus by Ba, Brenda and Heather. And this is a chameleon yarn from row one. It's one of those row packs things. That yeah. I, I think that's fun. I I think mm -hmm. it's going to be I, fun. I don't, I don't know if I will ever do the Row One uh, monthly subscription, but I really like the idea. Mm -hmm. I think yeah. it's really cool. I, and I have to, I, I love how she packaged it and everything. I mean, it came with all the little yeah. things wound on it and everything. And they all, they all pretty much have like similar color schemes. So you could take a couple of different companies yeah. and they're all very similar in weight and, and style and stuff. So I, I well, really don't you sign up for like, Sock weight. Yeah, it is. And then you all, get yeah, you get a sock you know, weight. Like yeah, but some sock savvy weights stains, are little, yeah, twelve different or twenty right. different colors right. in little ten. And the first time I saw it, leading men was the month was that month that month. Yeah, and then leading men were at the village yarn company with us, and and so that was my first experience seeing it. I think right. I, I think Karen had it like the week before, and then she brought it in that day, and it was yeah. like, oh my god, that's my first experience with leading men, and I like leading men. Speaking oh, of I love leading men, leading men are are doing our roving yarn this year. They are. Oh, are they? Yeah. yeah. Have yeah. you seen it? No, no not until like the end it. of the month. It doesn't start. Yeah, the um, our yarn shop. I've seen it in black and white. Well, wow. <laughs> Katie put it up in, on in, in black and Instagram white. in black and white. That so. was nice of her to do that. Well, she wow. can't She can't post the real color way. Well, it's not. nothing's even on. They don't um, even give you a hint on no, the website. They, no, they don't. They you can't. Know, no, they, they don't. So. Roving uh, Indiana is coming up. Yeah. And so yeah, there's for nine, those of you outside of the Indiana. Yeah. There's nine realm. different yarn shops within in central Indiana. I think it's that, down to seven. I thought she seven. said nine on her post. Maybe. Hmm. At any rate, yeah. There's from Indy to uh, how far north? Is there Fishers? Noblesville, Noblesville north yeah. to all the way down to Bloomington. Nashville, Indiana, well, yeah, Bloomington. Nashville, Columbus. Yeah, down that way. Yeah. Okay. So the, it's about an hour and a half, maybe hour, hour and a half south of Indy. So if you go straight up from Indy out, that's how we kind it's of a, do It's ours. an annual thing, guys, that the um, yarn shops here in Indiana have done. And they usually get an um, exclusive, they do get an exclusive colorway for just the shops that participate. And there's always been a passport. However, this year there isn't a passport. Mm -hmm. Just individual shops. Um, are just individual do. shops. But yeah, so it's a whole thing where you, if you went to the mall, then you got a, you know, your Sticker name and a, and a 
drawing and name and a drawing for big prizes and yeah. all that. Usually it's been fun for shop, us. So. Yeah, each shop usually does like a different kind of pattern that they put up with the yarn, which is really kind of nice to see it done. You yeah, know, other you places. To... Now I've seen other ones. Ours is one skein of yarn, but I've seen other places, other stuff like in Southern Indiana. They used to have where you got a different skein, color skein. Because, so oh. that was really kind of cool. So like you could do a fade thing, you know, with right. really yeah, that would be, yeah. yeah, that would really be neat the way that they they did yeah. it, you know. So that yeah. would be kind of fun too. Expensive, but fun. Our local yarn shop is going to be opening back up. Um, for for business this week. Not appointments are necessary. Yeah, not no appointments. Um I think it's eleven to four every day. Except Wednesday. Wednesday, yeah. Yeah. So if you're in the Zionsville area, Village Yarn Company is open. It is. Which is kinda nice. Again tomorrow or Tuesday? It said Monday. Okay. Monday, Monday Tuesday, Thursday, Monday, Friday. Monday, Tuesday, Saturday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Yeah, okay. 11 yeah. To 4. I mean if I were her I'd be I'd take off Sunday, Monday, but that's me. Well, maybe she likes having Wednesday off during the week. Maybe. You know. Apparently. Yeah. You know. So. But whatever. At any rate. Um, yeah. So. That's all we have, I think, this week then. That's all I have. It's a little bit slow. I am hoping to Wednesday. have that pattern done. Well, the, uh, well, at least the wrap done by next week. If nothing else, it gives her a goal to set every Sunday. Then so. I can work on something other than that, too. Well, mm -hmm. Yeah. I have to admit, I didn't get motivated to do my mitten until Thursday, and then it just kind of went, it just sped yeah. through, and I did a bunch of paperwork, and I got over the paperwork, getting ready for taxes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Don't want to do that, so I got to go like through. Taxes, no, I don't like yeah, that. It's not April yet. I don't have to worry about that. Oh, well, we get ours done the beginning of March, and they're all behind anyway, from what I understand, so... Are they? Oh yeah, I guess the IRS is like six months behind in their processing. So I um look out, we won't get anything. Okay, now this is where I screwed up. Hold on guys. Wait. I got We have to wait. wait. Yeah, you have to wait. Oh crap. You're supposed to knit two together. Uh, yeah, I know. I just realized I had it. And uh, I got a big hole. I got an here. email from the Bureau of Motor Vehicles telling me that my license plate renewal was due. Um I'd already sent the check, but um and then the uh, the they don't believe you when you say no. the check's in the mail? No. Damn them. And a couple of days later, um, it said, it's due today. And then a, a day later, it said, it's late. And I'm thinking, what do you want me to do? I could have, I don't know. Yeah, it, the check's in the mail. I send it. It's, <laughs> it'll be there soon. <laughs> Honestly. So. I just do that stuff online. Well, that's what I did. I did it online. But I pay for it online. I don't yeah. pay. I don't send a check. Oh, I sent. I had the bank send a check. And usually they're really efficient, so it'll get mm. there. They'll take it. It'll it'll all be fine. So, so, we, so there. So we can get you. All right. So if yeah. I pick up my phone and dial Zionsville Police, go right ahead. They'll pick you up on the way home. Hmm. Go right ahead. They're looking for something to do. No, what they would out. do is they would put it into the computer, and the computer would say, yeah, she's paid, but we haven't got the thing mailed out to her yet. That dinghy didn't bother to send us a check. She is. We're even for it One time I didn't I, pay I until know. May, and I still didn't. But this time I paid on time. It's good to know. She <laughs> paid on time. They could probably come in and just take a couple skeins of yarn for payment, too. It'd know? be about the same price. Yeah, you could say. <laughs> here, take this instead. <laughs> so anyway. I have a sweater quantity of yarn here, if that will do. Yeah, that works. The funny thing, the, the sweater. I have a sweater. <laughs> Actually, if you'd like one. Would you like to do this? Yeah. The sweater quantity of yarn cost less than these two skeins. Yeah. yeah. Well, I got a real so deal. She got a deal on it. So anyway. Yeah. All right, folks. I'm, Yeah. I'm I'm kind of up and ready. Okay. Um, Besides, my head's starting to hurt. We're we're still on the. Um, we're still looking for more subscribers. So if you've <laughs> subscribed, bless you. We love you. If you haven't subscribed and you happen to find us, please subscribe if you would. Um, leave us your comments and questions. The comments um, are fantastic. Love oh, the that's comments. Great. I got some. <laughs> you are completely covered up. <laughs> I did I love the comments. I did post the newsletter um, a couple of weeks ago. Have gotten some feedback on that. 
Um, so if Which you, is on Ravelry. It's on Ravelry in our Flock Around the Table group. group. So if you would like to read that and post your comments or questions, <clears throat> please feel free. Uh, other than that, have a good week. Exactly. Yeah. And here in Indiana, we're supposed to be getting snow. Snow, my um, God, it's supposed to be like zero out inches, there. Right? Yeah. Damn well, this morning was five degrees. Harley went out and I said, I just remind what them what our, what our Canadian counterparts oh. are at right now. They've had a week. Plus, of oh, 50, below, 50 below, guys. Yeah, and they're yeah, used to it. suntan weather compared to that. So. I know. Isn't that funny? That though? doesn't that doesn't make it warm. <clears throat> Next month it'll be forty degrees, and we'll be out getting a suntan. We will yeah. not. Well, we will. We'll be like, boy, is this Jamie warm will out be here? out golfing. He'll be out well, he'll golfing. He'll be out golfing. Yeah. I I never was a suntanner because I'm a sun fryer. I have. I specifically remember in college. And I was in, I was living in Minnesota in college one year for my birthday. So my birthday is in March. Um, the week of my birthday. That's a big one this year. Shut up. Um, yeah. The week of my birthday, I was out on my balcony, sun tanning in a bikini. Woo! <laughs> the week of my birthday. The <laughs> next week, we got 12 inches of snow. <laughs> That's Minnesota for you. Yeah, that's Minnesota for I'm you. I'm um, Yeah. Uh-huh. I can see I that. have never been a suntanner because... Uh-huh. Okay, I take that back. I One time I did I, I did the, the tanning booth because we were going to the Caribbean over Christmas. So I did the tanning booth. And then when I got to, I don't know, whatever island it was, I did not burn, which was good. Uh-huh. And I had I had a nice tan and... You know, I look like I've been somewhere tropical, and that's the only thing mm-hmm. I would I would do is just so that I come back with just a little bit of color, so that you can be a tad bit envious of where I've been. You know, you might you know I might as well tattoo on my forehead. I've been to Grand Cayman, yeah, because you know well, you, you pick can't... up a bit of a tan in the summer, just a bit, just, just a, a bit. bit, yeah, enough to. I'm pretty much tan most I, of the time. It just make kind of makes my freckles blend together a little bit. You look like you've been in the sun. You're all neither, pink. Neither one of these ladies. No, they, they haven't yeah. seen the light of day for a while. So anyway, have a nice Valentine's yeah. Day. Enjoy your day um, and enjoy your week. Stay warm if you're going to be out in the cold in Minnesota. Or, or in Indiana in the cold. Or Canada or even up in Sweden and, and oh England. Oh, my gosh. You know, yeah, everybody's, uh, you know, yeah, I, I everybody's suspect, cold now. Yeah. The ice we of, need to get subscribers from Australia <coughs> because I bet it's warm there. Well, it is. It's their summer. Do we have anybody from Australia? In Australia, so, leave us a they comment. say February. We need warmth. <laughs> people have said don't go to Australia in, in February because it's really hot and sticky. Yeah, and they had fires there last year. It was bad. Okay, so anyway. we're rambling. You yes, guys we have are. A good week. Well, we had topics come up at the very end. What do you? Want? Oh, we always have topics come up. Yeah, squirrel. All right, my head hurts. Love you guys. Have a Bye. good week. Have, have a, a good, good week. week. Keep knitting. Bye. Bye, Bye Ryan. Oh, Ryan. Bye, Ryan.